so today's videos is about a product that is called a liqui molly diesel intake system cleaner so uh, my regular viewers know this thing that i have a video on intake manifold cleaning but uh, i've been having a lot of comments that we are not that uh, technically uh, confident that we can remove our intake manifolds on our own so please guide some so please tell us some another way by which we can do this so this is your another way just in case uh, if you have haven't watched that video you can click the right top corner i'm linking the video uh, if you wanna if you still want to remove the complete intake manifold and then clean it so always 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 follow the directions on the bottle in multiple languages i guess here is english so you can read it uh, the product says it needs to be sprayed after the MAF sensor uh, so that it can uh, it cleans turbo the linings intercooler throttle plate which is in our case is called anti-shutter valve intake manifolds and then the valve stems the upper part of the valve stems but we are not going to do in the same manner and at the same time the car is also supposed to be on uh, 2500 rpm consistently so earlier i was thinking that i will need a friend uh, who can maintain the rpm from me but uh, later on i realized that i can simply put a brick on the accelerator pedal because our car have a rev lock a soft lock on 2500 rpm so i can do this alone and uh, always spray this uh, in short burst of two to three seconds so we'll start the work and explain it later on so according to the manufacturer we uh, need to disconnect this hose from here after the manifold after the map sensor but we are not going to do this because we have recently cleaned our uh, intercooler and uh, the anti shutter valve as well but i'm still going to clean the anti shutter again so what i'm doing is uh, i'll disconnect the hose from here and not completely pull it backwards uh, make some space and spray the content directly here so that our main focus can be just on the intake manifold and the valve stems so someone in in case someone has not seen the video of anti shutter valve and intercooler i'll link the videos in description as well as in the right top corner so that you can have a look so basically what i'm gonna do is unbolt this uh, hose clamp and pull this pipe backwards and create a little bit of space and this hose clamp is seven millimeter so we can see that i've already disconnected the hose from the anti shutter valve so that we can hold the sprayer uh, right here uh, while the engine is running and spray the entire can in here uh, a disclaimer you may have a uh, white smoke coming from your uh, exhaust pipe uh, it is pretty much normal in case of uh, intake and egr cleanings so don't freak out and one more disclaimer observe this area for any loose things because as the engine will start it will start to suck air inside and anything loose can get pulled inside so take a good look before starting the engine
so done cleaning uh, one more disclaimer i guess it's although too late but don't let it spill over your paint work and this thing is quite corrosive so protect your paint from paint work from this thing so this is the result and it's quite hard to get it off so keep that in mind so cleaning done uh, two things uh, which i really want to mention is first use gloves because after watching that uh, upper part of the grill i really got concerned that this thing is so damn corrosive it can really it can easily harm your screen second thing which i felt is i felt the fumes in my eyes so wear eye protection those two things are too damn important with this intake system cleaner so what i'm going to do now is i'm going for a i'm going for a drive and will tell you after i come back so driven the car almost 10 12 kilometers and the result is that you can't feel much on idle but uh, the thing you feel the most is uh, the car is much smoother to deliver the power i guess that's all due to the cleaned valve stems and better air flow around those valve stems and inside so maybe i have not read i have not reaped that much good results because i've already cleaned the intake manifold and almost each part of the air track the charge system but uh, yes the results are visible uh, you can notice that uh, when you are driving much more smooth the power delivery so that's my review of liqui moly diesel intake system cleaner or decarb whatever it is